long winning streak may guarantee you a title fight in other divisions, certainly doesn't at 170 pounds. But now, with all the contenders behind him, there is one man left standing. It is this man, the number one welterweight contender, now getting his shot at the dominant champion. And he believes, without a shadow of a doubt, that he is the best 170 in the world. And he is out to prove it right here, right now. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. for some time, but a lot of people think we could be looking at a new champion here tonight. The current champion, not one of them. He believes the hype is not real for the challenger. He believes he is much better than this young man, and now healthy, he is ready to prove that he's not just the best welterweight in the world at present, he is the greatest welterweight of all time. Winning this fight tonight against a significant challenger would certainly go a long way to proving just that. The champion is in focus right now. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this bout has been perfect. Everything ran according to plan. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. All right, now let's get you our tail of the tape for this welterweight championship fight. Both fighters 29 years of age with some differences in height and a similar reach. And now to get us started, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. The main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Steve Levin. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena, in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Welterweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 21 wins, 3 losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, presenting the challenger, the notorious Connor McGregor! And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 11 wins, one loss. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting at a Boca Raton Colada, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Kamaru, the Nigerian nightmare, Uspa. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to I am home. very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go ready? down right now. Scheduled for five rounds if need be. All right, so without further delay, here we go. Round one is underway. It's the UFC Welterweight Championship. And there is the champion out of the red corner working his way to the center of the octagon. He has defended this belt in the past and believes if he can do so again tonight. And here and still, he could go down as one of the greatest 170-pound fighters in UFC history. In order to do just that, he has said, I've got to get off to a good start here tonight. We'll see if he attacks offensively here. 
Nice shot to the body. Joe, your thoughts on what we might see here? One thing to keep an eye out for in this fight are the counter shots of Conor McGregor. Oh, he gets... Oh! oh! Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt bad. And there he swung with a haymaker. McGregor's kick to the body. That one blocked. So more output, at least in the early going. Oh! Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Now he's in full mount. Yeah, that did hurt. You saw the wince. Oh, big shot from the top. Into full guard. Nice reversal. Full guard. Nice hammer fist. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Back to full mount again. Oh, and he connects there. Orthodox for much of the fight. He's going southpaw here, Joe. Ooh. It's under three minutes now to go on the round. Oh, that's a good strike there by Usman. McGregor gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit. Big shot to the head. head. He's stunned. He's in trouble. He's got him hurt here. Turn him with that uppercut. Wow! wow! That one appeared to stun him. The champ is rocked. He's in deep trouble right now. Deep trouble. He's trying to hang on. Oh, a huge block there. Jab. He was almost moving into it, so let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. He will have to dig deep here. He's hurt to the body. Under two minutes to go in a back-and-forth first round here. How about that shin? Oh! He's got him hurt here. Oh, he's stunned again! Big trouble. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Body kick, look at that. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by McGregor. Well, he's got a strong jab. Miss with it there, though, Joe. for the victory. Yeah, Joe, just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. Let's see it one more time. Look at the power in this hook as it lands for the knockout. And here we see it again. Boom! Wow! So there he is, the undisputed UFC welterweight champion. What a finish he turned in here tonight as he gets it done by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 55 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new! been talking about those two words throughout fight week and new UFC champion. He completes the mission here tonight. 
and you can see the emotion spilling over. Absolutely incredible what this fighter was able to accomplish, and it is going to take a special performance to dethrone the new UFC champion of the world.